Yo, what's up? We are full swing into the holiday season. We are buying gifts, giving thanks, and most importantly, having no money for plugins. I'm broke, nigga, I'm broke! So now we gotta resort to some free ones. Now there's a lot of eclectic and sometimes silly plugins out there that do have a reputation of being a bit difficult to use, but there are so many powerful free plugins that could definitely spice up your production and improve your workflow. And let's be real guys, if it's for free, then it's for me. You best believe I get as many samples as I can at Costco. So today, I'm gonna make a new jazz type beat using only free plugins. Some of these are pretty common knowledge, but I still enjoy using them, and then I'm gonna throw in some more interesting plugins throughout the video. I'll also put the links in the description if you wanted to download any of the plugins I use today. This will probably be my last video of the year, so happy holidays, and thank you for tuning into the channel and showing your support. And today's also a pretty big day for me. It's my birthday. I'm 26 now and wow, I've, it's crazy to think I've been doing this for the past six years. I am eternally grateful for all of the support you guys give me. Thank you so much. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to give thanks real quick. Onto the beat, enjoy. We're gonna set the tone with a very different type of free plugin. This one is Alter Ego. Alter Ego is a free text-to-speech software with multiple voices that you can choose from. You can also change the articulation and vibrato of the vocal performance and add some of the onboard effects. One of the cool things about this plugin is that some of the vocals can be used to sing in different languages, like French or Japanese. The voice I'm using is called Bones, and I'm gonna play a simple melody with it. I also just have it playing this cool, kind of edgy phrase, love it when you hate me. I just thought it sounded nice. And then to fill the gaps in the phrase, I use another instance of Alter Ego. It's just playing the word I. Sometimes on playback, I would get these different vocal breaths coming from the plugin, and I thought it sounded kind of interesting. So I recorded a few of them in Edison, and I'm gonna be using this little breath sound in different sections of the beat. I added a few stock plugins to help fit the vocals into the beat, like a limiter, a few EQs, a stereo shaper, sound goodizer, and a reverb. Now we can't have a video about free plugins without mentioning the goat of all things synthesis, Vital. Vital is a three oscillator synthesizer packed with tons of control. You can customize and create your own wavetables, and it has this dope drag and drop feature where you can add it to any parameter in the plugin. I also absolutely love all of the built-in effects as well. Everything is made with such meticulous design and quality. You can make gorgeous melodic sounds and even heavy basses with this plugin. It is a staple if you want to get into synthesis or sound design, a truly vital plugin. For my track, I started off with this nice chord progression using a preset that I made. Then I layered that with this top melody using a sine lead. I also added some simple effects like an EQ and a stereo shaper. That's it. I absolutely loved how this turned out, and I'm not gonna lie, your boy's getting nice on the keys. And you can practice as well with Melodics. Melodics is a desktop app that helps you build your skills with your MIDI keyboard. With over 1,500 courses, lessons, and exercises to choose from, Melodics covers every aspect of learning the piano, from the notes and finger placements to practicing scales and hand coordination and everything's organized in different courses that you can explore through the newly revised Guided Path tab. Melodics keeps track of your timing and accuracy while you play, and it gives feedback on what you need to work on. It makes learning the piano pretty fun and intuitive. The courses are also designed with different genres in mind, so if you want to practice hip-hop, funk, or jazz, Melodics has you covered. And Melodics has recently introduced songs, and you can learn how to play real songs from real artists. You could jam out to Silk Sonic, Jamiroquai, or even ASAP Rocky. And with the knowledge you gain from Melodics, you could take that experience into the real world, like working on your own music, jamming out in a studio session, or even performing live. If you want to try Melodics out, I'll have a link in the description. It's free to download. Next up, I'm going to use this crazy space synth, 
Iliano. This plugin has been around for quite some time now, and you can kind of tell because it's only in 32 bit and it keeps counting down when 2012 will happen. But this has kind of been like a hidden gem plugin from GOAT producers like Metro Boomin, so I had to include it. I'm gonna be honest though, this isn't really a plugin I tend to do sound design on. It kind of reminds me of like the Taco Bell menu where you don't really go into Alien with a plan, it'll tell you what you need. And for my beat, I needed a sick lead melody. I also use another free plugin, Surge, to play this exact same melody. I talked about Surge in my last free plugin video, so I'm gonna just leave it here. Next, we're gonna add some more size to the beat using a great retro style synthesizer, Cheese Machine 2. I really like this plugin. It's not flashy, but the presets in it are simple and effective. It's kind of like my go-to synth for 80s style string stuff, and it's really nice that they have free expansions on their website. It's just great stuff all around. I have it playing the main chords, but I also arpeggiated some notes here and there. And the only effects I'm adding for this is a high pass EQ and another excellent free plugin that I've talked about before, Fresh Air, just to boost some highs. Now I'm gonna talk about some free effect plugins. And I'm gonna start this off with Pancake. Pancake is a hard panning tool with a built-in LFO to shape the panning. You can also change the LFO speed to warp how fast you want it to go, or draw in points to create a completely unique waveform. It can add some interesting movement or character to your sound. In my song, I kept it pretty simple, and I'm gonna use it to pan the alter ego vocals. And I'm gonna lump the last two effects in together because they're both from Baby Audio. I'm using Magic Switch and Magic Dice. Magic Switch is a plugin that gives you that vintage 80s chorus effect all at the touch of a button. It's actually a part of a bigger plugin called Super VHS, which gives you even more effects. But because the chorus effect is so good, they just made it its own thing. For my track, I'm using it all over the place, like on the Ultra Eagle vocals. and on the Cheese Machine synth. Magic Dice is a plugin that generates a random delay and reverb effect. It's a one button plugin, just like Magic Switch, except every time you roll the dice, it is a completely unique effect, and you'll never hear the same result twice. I actually kind of like that level of uncertainty with this, you know? Keeps you on your toes. I use this plugin in my instance of Alieno just to give it some nice delay over time. Okay, we're getting into the drums now. And I'm not gonna lie, I didn't use any free plugins for the drums. I apologize. However, the sounds I'm using are pretty basic trap drums, and you can find them pretty much anywhere. I'm just using the simple hi-hat, claps, and this nice rim shot. I also added this hard-hitting kick for later parts of the song. Next, I added a few different 808s. And I'm gonna make this crazy bass pattern. I like how this came out. I think each bass had its own moment to shine. Let's finish off this beat with some simple yet tasteful transition sounds. And here's the final beat. Oh. 